ADOT worker and his rancher brother were out here in the area earlier this month. They were trying to get a hold of a bull that had wandered onto the highway when they look over and they see a broken fence. They start looking into uh, what may have plowed through that fence and that's when they find this, a mangled car stuck in a mesquite tree about 50 feet down from the side of the road. Zach Morales says he and his brother called 911 and that's when tra uh, Trooper Caleb Hegel shows up and then more ADOT workers show up. They fan out uh, to search for the driver. Zach's brother found some tracks and that's what led this search crew to the 53 year old woman. She was in very bad shape. Trooper Hegel approached her first to make sure she was even alive. I had everyone pull back. Um, we had all the ADOC crew there with me. Um, I, I came up to her, I shook her, to see what, if she was alive. As soon as the trooper said, you know, it's okay, he flagged me over. And then I began asking her just a series of questions. You know, are you hurting? Where does it hurt? You know, are you breathing okay? We then uh, started giving her water, really dehydrated. So Trooper Hegel got the story uh, from this woman about how this even happened. Apparently it was pouring outside when she was driving eastbound here on the US 60. She went to make a U-turn and in that pouring rain, she lost control of her car and that's when she plummeted off the side of the road. But DPS telling me today that she is out of the hospital. Reporting live just outside Wickenburg, Carissa Planel for Arizona's Family.